President Bola Tinubu, President of the Senate, Gatsu Lapabio, and uh, Attorney General of the Federation AGF, the Minister of Justice Latif Agwemi, SAN, expressed on Wednesday the determination of the present administration to give a fresh direction to the justice sector in the country through a holistic overhaul of the sector. They made the commitment in Abuja at the opening of a two-day national summit on Justice 2024 with the theme, Repositioning the Justice System, Constitutional, Statutory and Operational Reforms for Access and Efficiency. The President Tinubu, represented by the Vice President of Haji Kashim Shatima, said the administration is committed to ensuring a just society that will support and encourage investment. I accordingly urge the leadership of all justice sector institutions to seek a new direction and focus on outcomes by creating a justice system that fully responds to the needs of our citizens. One that serves Nigerians now and for generations to come. The impact of their reform efforts should be visible in terms of improved access to justice, strengthen integrity of justice sector institutions, increase timeliness and quality of justice delivery, accountability and transparency of the system, and ultimately improve public trust and confidence in the judicial system. First try and cope the misuse of expert orders in political, in political matters, particularly by our judges, by the judiciary. To cope this, it is imperative that the National Judicial Council, the NJC, exercises stringent oversight. We recommend prompt and decisive punishment. Oh, I was going to turn for judges, but maybe for the officers involved who are found to abuse this authority in any manner. We further propose that the NGSC should establish clear and detailed standards you know, governing the issuance of ex parte orders accompanied by a defined set of sanctions and, uh, in the case of violations. These sanctions should be severe enough to serve as deterrent against future abuses. The cast for justice should not be a privilege reserved for the few, but a right accessible to all, regardless of their circumstances. Therefore, it is incumbent upon us to embark on a journey of comprehensive reform to ensure that justice is not only dispensed, but also perceived to be dispensed fairly and impartially. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.